Nintendo Switch releases March 3rd. Wait, really? Yeah. What? Nice. I don't know. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't like double check what we could talk about, so I'm just going to not talk about stuff. Is just ask good? questions and I will okay. answer appropriately. Okay, so Breath of the Wild is, on, is about to release. Uh, it's yes. an open world game. We were talking about open world games before. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm Legend confirming Zelda. things. <laughs> It'll be, be made by Nintendo. Yes. In Japan. Yes. It'll be on the Nintendo Switch. Yes. And the Wii U. And the Wii U. Don't forget about that. The Wii U was Zelda's Nintendo's previous console. Yes. This has gone on the too Wii far. Can we <laughs> <laughs> um, and we wanted to talk about whether Horizon Zero Dawn, because it was so surprising as an open world game, will hold you over until Breath of the Wild comes out, if not even compete with it in terms of an open world game. Right. Because uh, Breath of the Wild, for what we've seen, is the closest Zelda hasn't got back to that first Zelda, which is completely open, just more like emphasizing exploration, but obviously to like the hundredth degree in this case on the mm -hmm. Nintendo the Switch. Hundredth. Just, by, just times 100. hundred. Take yeah. the first Zelda, multiply it by hundred. That's what you get. That hundredth degree and times hundred are very different. I know, but <laughs> I don't want to talk about exponents right now. I just <laughs> want to talk about whether Horizon Zero Dawn will hold you over until Breath of the Wild comes out in terms of being an open world game. All right, so based on my previous experience playing Zelda at events, right, like mm -hmm. E3 and stuff, I'm trying to contextualize where I'm presenting this interview. Okay. I can walk off set. It's cool. No, don't do <laughs> that. All right, so... Yes, all the things you said were true, like having fucking embargoes. Ah, put it ah! down. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So having played a little bit of Breath of the Wild in the past and then jumping into Horizon, yes, I immediately had that feeling of, crap, am I spoiling Breath of the Wild for myself by playing this game, right? Open world, survival's a thing. Bow and arrow is, you know, like what you use most mm -hmm. of the time, and that was some of the, a source of some of the best footage of Breath of the Wild, like the slow-mo bow shots, like, mm -hmm. oh, damn, that's in Horizon, right? Well, uh, after going through Horizon, I can certainly say that what I expect from Zelda, Horizon gave me something different. There are certain parallels to be drawn. I think you can play both games and not get burnt out. I mean, time will tell. Um, but, but certainly Horizon is its own beast. But it definitely has that, like if you need like a taste of Zelda, if you can't get it right away, but you have a PS4, I encourage you to try Horizon because it offers similar things mechanically. It seems like there's much more, from what I know of Breath of the Wild, it seems like there is much more room for uh, emergent situations. Like things happening uh, that you might not initially even consider. Because I know that happens in Horizon a little bit, but it seems like Zelda, you can, like, from what we saw, you can snowboard down the slope on that thing. You can jump off and paraglide. Those, those are mechanical layers. Right. But the, I mean, you like, in, terms of, like, think of, in like, terms of, like, not knowing that if you're in a thunderstorm, this, okay, this, okay, like, sure. metal suit is going to shock you. I don't see as many, yeah. like, um, you know, unfactored situations happening that might mm. happen in Breath of the Wild yeah. in Horizon Zero Dawn because I've been playing oh, like four or five hours of this right. and it seems a little more predictable than Zelda. Not in a bad way. Um, it just seems more condensed. Zelda seems like there are way more overlapping mechanics. I mean, in a, in a way you could say, because yes, based on all the footage coming out of like previous events, one of the things people were talking about was did you see this thing in Breath of the Wild? What? You can do that? No. Did you see this thing? Oh, my God. Like Yeah, everybody was, did something different. Right. That was yeah. the story there. And so Horizon is, in, in that context, a simpler game. Um, Zelda certainly will have a lot of surprises based on what we've seen up to this point. Like It I mean, seems to indicate that like you're going to have to learn things on the fly. Especially the beginning of Horizon is a lot more linear. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you get a little bit of time to do side questing and stuff, but uh, when we... Like at E3, when everybody was playing demos of Zelda, it was like, I went to a mountain. What? There was a mountain? Oh, yeah. And I didn't have clothes on, so I froze. What? Like, you were you naked? Know, yeah. <laughs> like, wait, you didn't have clothes on? Like, so, um, yeah, in that sense, I think what we've been exposed to so far uh, has been a lot less uh, linear than maybe what uh, your initial, like, what you know about Horizon, if you haven't seen anything but, like, previews. Uh, it's, it's less linear than what you've seen from that. Yeah. Josh Shaw in Twitch chat is saying that they're going to be different because one's Japanese, the other is Western. Is Way to Horizon, be reductive, Josh. Well, is Horizon... That's Horizon's like, Western style, but it's not a Western... Oh, yeah, it's from Amsterdam. I mean, <laughs> yeah. I think you can look at maybe just that, that quintessential Nintendo charm <clears throat> yeah. and see how no game can ever really replicate that as well, well as a Nintendo game. Link <laughs> is, like, such a dork, and I love that about him. <laughs> 3D like, dot game hero is good. Like, when you... Yeah, but it's different. <laughs> Stop. People did like that game. I'm just you, being you contrarian. Know, actually, anyway. uh, um, when like when he cooks, he's humming and stuff, and it's just a it's a very different uh, character perspective, I guess. Um, if that makes sense, like yeah. like Horizon is much more like 
there's some serious shit going oh fuck um yeah, yeah. everyone's uh, it. Uh, just for the record i gave both of them the dollars they've put in there yeah don't, okay, so, okay look i'll give have, you a dollar when we leave yeah don't for the record us. for the record no you one don't, can see me on camera right not, now but i'm that's posing not, to the camera thank that's you that's not relevant look i have <laughs> a dollar me. i have a dollar just it's not patronizing in the opposite pocket. stop condescending to me no i'm a patron no those aren't the opposite anyway um condescending and patronizing are not the same they're not the same, but they're not opposite. They're pretty opposite. No, one they're is, not. One is putting someone down. One is like trying to make someone else feel better by putting. Them down. <laughs> no, you, I they're know not they opposites. Are. Um, no, you stop. You forfeited the words. Uh, you forfeited editorship, so you Whatever. don't get to tell me what words oh, mean. Oh, oh shit! Um, oh, More video team get betrayed. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, or like what we're seeing here right now. Just bring it back. Uh, like the uh, moving the environment versus in horizon there's much more uh you know using the environment to do things for your like you don't use the environment in the same way so you're harvesting things from the environment but like uh, what i've seen from breath of the wild what i've played of breath of the wild is very much uh like finding clever ways to interact with the environment if mm -hmm. that makes sense yeah like yeah. how do i chop down a tree without an axe well i can figure it out maybe yeah you know it's weird because Breath of the Wild's world is gorgeous and doesn't initially seem dangerous, but from what I've actually played, it is, and mm -hmm. survival's a big part of it, whereas yeah. Horizon yeah. seems very dangerous, but I... It's a lot less dangerous. Yeah. 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 It's still dangerous. I mean, there are some right. tough animals to fight, but I haven't had too much trouble yet. The game is very generous in terms of being like, you can just pick up plants and keep them in your pocket, sure. and when you need to munch some for health, do it. Whatever. Yeah. Like, you can you Or can you can make a yourself. health potion. Yes. Yeah. Or you can make health potions. Yeah. You can heal yourself pretty readily in... Um, Horizon. Yeah, I would be remiss if I did not get to some of the Twitter questions we had earlier this week remiss. about Horizon. Don't be remiss. Um, remiss isn't. That's the <laughs> remiss. Be remiss. Remiss. What did I say? Remiss. Remiss. I'm sorry. I'm just okay. <laughs> let's not do this grammar thing now. <laughs> we, we we don't need that on. Okay. <laughs> Page three glamour babes. Pete he really on is Twitter. Mac. Is uh, not Mac. He Dennis. He's, he's Dennis. He's so Dennis. As hell. Wow. Yeah. They're talking about it's always sunny if you don't have the inside <laughs> Uh Page three glamour babes on Twitter was saying, "How long is the game? And are, are there any side missions, quests to do? Yeah, there are side missions and quests for sure. Yeah. I mean, I spent about sixty hours, eighty two percent completion rating, and I didn't focus on side quests that often. Yeah. Um, Daniel Noss said, thoughts on the best game developers? Sony has exclusives with all of them. I don't think that's true, Ooh. but no, it's, <laughs> got, it's got a few. There are, there are more quote unquote best game developers out there. Yes. Uh, am I going to be able to hunt animals or is it just machines? That's about Horizon, which I'm sure uh, you discerned. You also hunt animals and they are a source of the sort of natural resources like bones and hides that you use to create pouches. Yeah. Um, and you also use them for a few other things. So, uh, yes. Meat can be used for health potions and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. There's like, isn't there different kinds of meat? There's like bony meat and mm -hmm. fresh, fatty meat. Fatty meat. And rich yeah. meat. Right. <laughs> which, right, how is right. that different from fatty meat? I don't know. Uh, fatty is fatty. Rich is, uh, rich connotes fat. Richard, who? Richard, <laughs> Richard, <laughs> my, my the brother. Richard meat. Yeah. Um, <laughs> oh, anyway, my no, not fat brother. No. <laughs> so yeah, let us know what you think. Or <laughs> let us know what you think. Will Horizon Zero Dawn hold you over until Breath of the Wild comes out? Let us know next week once you play. We'll circle back to it. Uh, we'll be on Twitter, obviously. Pete Brown, Kelly Plaggy, Mike Mahardy. Let us know what you think of Horizon once you play it next week or if you've already played it. I don't know, depending on what your profession is. Uh, and let us know what you think about it. And uh, yeah. Yeah.